The software allows you to create multiple views of different types. 3D views, 2D top views, section and elevation views. In a typical project you will need a separate view for each floor plan, one or more section views and four elevations showing the building from each side. While you are designing your building, you can continue with a single 2D and 3D view and create all the additional views when your planning is done. Each view has its own visibilities so you can easily use our project viewer to show the ground floor in one and the upper floor in a second view. Open the view property dialog to give it a name and to specify the scale. Within our project viewer you can create category folders and move your existing views to it so that you can easily switch multiple views on and off with a single mouse click. On the view ribbon you find the section view tool. The same tool is used to create sections and elevations. While section views are crossing your floor plan elevation views need the section line in front of the facade with a visible depth over the entire building. Keep the control key pressed while you draw the section line. That enables our internal angle grid and ensures that you draw accurate vertical or horizontal lines. Both, sections and elevations have a view option called hidden line, which must be activated for an accurate display. Since all views in our software are updated simultaneously, every active view with hidden line calculation takes some seconds or more, depending on your project content. The hidden line function should either be activated when you need it, or views with active hidden line option should temporarily be disabled in our project viewer while you are working on your project. The project viewer allows you to define a view visibility layer-wise. In addition you can open the view visibility dialog and specify in detail the elements you want to see, 